five in tears. I appreciate what you said at the church, but it doesn't do us any good. Neither does this. Well, what can I do to help? You can't do anything. She's gone. You're right, I can't change that. But I can make sure the city offers you a sizable settlement. You mean buy us off? No, I mean help you avoiding years of court battles. Uh, Jessica was going to go to Furman, is that right, on a volleyball scholarship? Yes, a full ride. Well, I spoke to the president of the university this morning, and we'd like to create a new scholarship in your daughter's name. If you'd like that, it's entirely up to you. But most importantly, we have to make sure that this never happens again. We've got safety billboards going up, uh, stop lighting the tower at night, and we're putting the guardrails in. Should have done all that before she ran off the road. Would you like me to resign, Mr. Masters? Just say the word and it's done. If it will bring you any satisfaction. I asked the Reverend once, what are we supposed to do in the face of so much senseless pain? And he said to me, what else can we do but take what seems meaningless and try to make something meaningful from it? He's right. That's how God works through us. Will you let me work for you? What you have to understand about my people is that they are a noble people. Humility is their form of pride. It is their strength. It is their weakness. And if you can humble yourself before them, they will do anything you ask. Tell us more about the scholarship. 